Hi, Chris Walls from Second Swing. We're at the 2018 PGA Merchandise Show in Orlando. We're with Mura this morning, talking with Jason Rakowski. How's it going, Jason? Having a great day, Chris. Great show. A lot of buzz around the new product line for 2018. Yeah. Exciting year for you guys. You got some new stuff coming out. We're going to talk about some of the new irons. Specifically right now, we're going to talk about the IC601. Yes. Tell us a little about this new iron. I know there's a lot of really interesting technology going on here. Well, Mura's long been known for its forged modern blades. Uh, what we wanted to do is branch out, kind of expand our demographic of golfer and provide something that has that premium look and feel of a Mura, but a little bit more forgiveness that the average golfer can use. Yeah, and so this is a hollow design, which is going to do a lot of things from a weighting standpoint to generate a lot of MOI and forgiveness for golfers. Absolutely. A little bit bigger platform, like you mentioned, two pieces, super hot, carpenter steel, 455 piece. Uh, gives it a lot of ball speed off the face, but then also the, the design of the body being forgive, forgiveness. Yeah, and what's, you know, you can see a little bit of mass, a little bit of wider sole, which is going to give some players, like you said, that forgiveness. But in the playing position, it looks like classic mirror. That's exactly right. And one of the initial things that we've seen in player testing is that it gives you that look feel, but also the trajectories that you're looking for as you start to see a product with a little bit stronger lofts, which is the tendency nowadays as it relates iron to iron. Yeah. So typically, who are you going to see as sort of the target player for this iron if you're going to sort of look at it from a handicap range? Well, if you look at our, our, our portfolio of irons, we're going to put this one right in the middle. It's not super game improvement like the Genesis, and it's also not going to be the small baby blade that you're going to see out of a tour professional. It's going to fall right in the gamut. It's going to cover probably the widest handicap of golfers because it is going to appeal from a look, feel, and a performance standpoint. And I would imagine this will be a great option maybe for that, that guy who's maybe like me, pretty good player getting a little older, wants to look at something clean, but could use a little more distance and forgiveness. That's exactly right. I mean, it's uh, if you, you check your ego aside and, and, <laughs> and open, your, open your eyes to what potentially you could fit into and have the best performance standpoint, we've gotten a lot of good feedback from just, you know, low handicap players that, hey, I love the way this looks and I love the fact that it just goes high and straight. Yeah, great looking irons, Jason. We appreciate it. Thanks. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you.